What's going on you guys? This is Andrew Roboto here and today I would like to do a commentary slash reaction video on How the Nerds Stole Christmas which is a video by the Angry Video Game Nerd aka James Rolfe. Now for those who don't know who the Angry Video Game Nerd is, he does these... A lot of these, he does um, a, a video game series called the Angry Video Game Nerd where he reviews like all games that are like... that are like... Shh, or, how do I describe it? He reviews these games that are quote unquote shitty, and he like makes a re and he like reacts to all the games and complains about all the bad stuff about it, the pros and the cons. He like talks about that in the whole games, and he always ends the video with destroying the game, and that's what makes it funny as hell. So uh, yeah, and anyways, this video is a parody to How the Grinch Stole Christmas, which is a classic Christmas movie, and it's one of my favorites. So yeah, I thought I'd just react to this because it is pretty funny. Anyways, on to the video. How the Nerds Stole Christmas by James Wolfe, a.k.a. the Angry Video Game Nerd. Illustrations by Mike Matty, Matai, sorry if I pronounced the last name wrong. Narrated by William Mulvey. Music by Bear McCreary. A Cinemassacre production, 2010. Based on the story How the Grinch Stole Christmas by Dr. Seuss. Every gamer down in Gainville liked Christmas. Ooh, Gainville. <laughs> nice. Who lived just north of Gainville did not. He did not he like Christmas. Christmas Eve, staring down from his cave with a sour, nerdy frown. Nerdy frown. Warm lighted windows below in their town. <laughs> oh, Christmas. That time of year when everyone gets an awesome new video game. But the ones wow. I always get are so unspeakably lame. Exactly. The Wall Street Kid is a game about cash and stock. Oh, I've never heard of this well, game. We'll play it. Well, Christmas socks with trash and severed cat cocks. <laughs> cat cocks. <laughs> I can't move while spitting and die in one hit. Killing time on 3DO doesn't give you enough ammo. Your parents pay 50 bucks for a game where you shoot the fuck out of them. No kidding, they pay 50 sucks. bucks for a video game. I'd rather eat the sea skunk yeast than play inferior arcade ports like Altered Beast. Altered Beast is a nut kicking feast I can't. <laughs> nut kicking. Then there's games that are so ridiculously hard. Giving a reasonable challenge is something the programmers disregard. Last Action Hero. I That's another game I've never heard of or played. Getting whacked to death by Ernest P. Worrell sends me into a fit of Oh, wow. I, lo I love the baseball bat in this Atari? game. What is this shit? I love how that guy's just getting whacked by the baseball bat. SCAT stands for Special Cybernetic... Another game I've never heard of or played. ...rockings of carnivorous mammals is what the word SCAT really means. It's as close as you can get to a Nintendo game called shit. Balls, <laughs> Shit. Aptly named travesty on Balls. That makes no sense and is a I've heard of this game, but I never played it. I'd be so let down playing on Ooh, Ronald McDonald's in the game. Nice. <laughs> Ronald McDonald. gamers get to play something he or she enjoys, while I get the ones with terrible graphics and all Very terrible boys, graphics. Boys. If they play two seconds of Ultraman, they throw Ultraman, huh? Second. I've heard of Mega Man, but I've never heard of Ultraman. Get the nauseating effect of Marsupilami. Nauseating <laughs> effect. <laughs> that's a bunch of shit sauce and salon. Shit sauce. Mad <laughs> Max. They take offense to Taboo the Sixth Sense. They shriek, squeaks, and squeals, racing around with Bigfoot's uncontrollable. Oh wow, that's pretty cool. They try kicking in Pit Fighter like there's lead weights. Nice tiger. street fighting. Love that fighting. They try skating and skate or die without falling flat. Now I've actually played skate. I've actually played skateboarding games. Video games. They're actually kind of fun, especially the Tony Hawk series. Tony Hawk series, as well as cartoon skating. I love those games. Oh, I love Guitar Hero. I pl I played Guitar Hero and Rock Band. I played all the games. Oh, nice. Nice. Love that game. Sing, sing, sing. Love that game. <laughs> I've played every Guitar Hero and Rock Band game, actually, except for, um, Guitar Hero 1 and 2, Encore Rocks the 80s, as well as, um, Rock Band 4. Those games I haven't played yet, but I've wanted to play them for a long time. I must stop this whole thing. 
put up with this long enough. Now, I have to find a way to stop Christmas from coming. But how? Then he got an idea. But how will we stop Christmas? The nerd got a wonderful... Oh, he's got the evil idea. face. I know just what to do. The nerd laughed in his throat. I'll make a quick Santa Claus hat and a coat. And he chuckled and clucked. What a great nerdy trick. <laughs> this coat and this hat, I'll look just like Saint Nick. While all the gamers are asleep tonight, I'll give them some games they can play alright. Wow, that's a cool game right there. On Mr. Nerd. You're a mean one. Mr. Grinch. <laughs> Mr. Nerd! <laughs> I wouldn't mind you when you're playing Atari Berserk! Then the sleigh started down toward the town where the gamers lay a snooze without Gainville, nice. Came to the first little house. Good name for a town. This is stop number one. Stop number one. He climbed to the roof. Bags of shitty games in his face. Bags of shitty games. <laughs> oh, I love the Super Mario reference. I love that. Ooh, rock. Ooh, a guitar hero guitar. Look at that. Sony PlayStation 3. Those are cool kits to get. There's also an Xbox 360 up there. or I think it's a one. I don't know what the Xbox is. I don't know what kind of Xbox that is. There's also... Some classic game controllers, same with the Wii and Xbox 360 the game, which is Call of Duty. I think it's Black Ops 1 or 2 or something. Ooh, Rock Band 2, nice. And we got an Xbox 360. That's the Xbox that was there, the 360. Ooh, we got some cool games, nice. Or shitty games, quote unquote. Three Stooges. Captain America, the Punisher, Bill and Ted. TNC Surf Design. That one's pretty good. Like a rat's ass, they'd like it. That <laughs> That's all you need to know. It's the worst surfing experience you'll ever undergo. No kidding, it's it is. Low, and there's a cat in a tuxedo. A cat in a tuxedo? It's really a freak show. You move around, staying adrift on a motionless tide. One wrong move, and it's the end of your ride. Even if you're doing fine, you'll suddenly get hit by a bird. It's as much fun as wringing the stank juice out of a turd. Wow. Skating may be the really? best part, but it's still just as delightfully tart as a broccoli bean burrito eating skunk that's ready to fart. <laughs> You're a mile one. You're a mile one. Grizzly bear. We'll see how they like circus caper. It's circus caper, huh? Chewbacca's anal vapor. You're running around, knocking down carnival performers, and the crowd are all clowns. Why are the clowns in the audience and not in the show? Why do they spell the name of the game? What shame, we'll never know. When you punch people, items fly straight up in the air. That's unfair, it makes me rip out my hair. The hell with Sir Isaac Newton, they don't care. Isaac Those Newton? Must come down. Not in this game, they were just fucking around. What turkeys worked on this murky mess of monkey jerky? Some quirky jackass from Albuquerque? Punching, <laughs> kicking, lunging, and sticking. Short range attack, bending way back, like a broom somewhat, been shoved up your butt. What's that? Bonus stages to keep score? What for? Since Atari, score doesn't matter anymore. When you die, you go back. Only one chance. Cut me some slack. In this stage, I'm Yeah, cut me around. some slack, like please. Stay up, but they force me to go down. There's no buffer. You can't touch the bottom of the screen. Killed by invisible airspace. The stupidest thing I've ever seen. Tiny elephants, a kangaroo in a ring, a guy with a sword, all crazy things. Throwing soccer balls at a shit sack. What were they smoking? <laughs> Jumping in and out of magic hats, fighting over meat with white cats. Save the girl, why am I not thrilled? She was a target for knife throwing? Too bad she didn't get killed. How about well, too bad she didn't get that killed. That really sucked. Dodging eagle poop in a car? <laughs> Nothing's more high class than the Statue of Liberty going right up your ass. <laughs> boots appeared on the title screen. Put some boots on the title screen. What's that mean? 
That's and pretty interesting. Star? Gee, that's bizarre. Very bizarre. Jump takes you to the top of the screen. <laughs> Damn, you almost touched the score. What are you on a trampoline? Trying to break blocks, just can't hit the spot. With those white socks, just kick till you rot. Walk yeah, no real. Why can't you run? So tedious. That's no fun. The boss exploded after I died. Whoa! The Did boss vanish? exploded after I, I died. Nice. Going upstairs. Where am I? I believe now? it's the other way no around. Continuity. I don't see how. One minute I'm here, one minute I'm there. I just reappear any place, anywhere. Guys jumping through the roof. This game is so glitched. Now they're coming through the floor. What's going on? Such a this bitch. game is so messed up. Can't exactly. Get to the doors, like this big one. How can you ignore? Finding the right door is such a chore. Come on, where do I go? What a bore. Yeah, where do Finally, you go? When you do find the right door, how do you go in? Want to know the way? Not up, not down. By pressing right, B and A. That's oh, a weird control to do. Why is it so stinking? I'm staring, unblinking. What were they thinking? Yeah, what were they thinking, people? More of the theme. Oh, that's Home Alone for the NES. Or Home Alone 2, my bad. Home Alone 2. Yeah. I've actually played Home Alone 1 and 2, but only for the Game Boy. Or, let me think. Yeah, for the Game Boy. I've played them both, and let me tell you, the graphics are shitty. And they're not that fun of a game to play. In fact, in fact, both game, both Home Alone games have nothing to do with the movie. Like, you're literally just trying to defend yourself from enemies, which which you, which Kevin doesn't do in the movies. In the movies, Kevin defends himself from Marvin Harry. But in the video games, he's defending himself from the enemies, not just Marvin Harry. And it's just, it's just weird. It was in the morning light when all the gamers began to rise. And in the nerd's delight, eagerly listened in on their Eagerly surprise. listened in. <laughs> That's what they'll do, those swines. They'll play those horrible games. <laughs> swines. Christmas will be ruined, like all mine. The nerd Are you sure about see. that, James Walsh? Their sounds growing fast. At first, they were aghast. Why then? They started to laugh. Every game down in Gainville, the tall and small, was playing. Oh, wow, they started the laughing? They started laughing at every crappy game they played. That's too funny. <laughs> It'd be funny if this was in the Grinch movie. It'd be funny if that happened. Because in the movie, the Grinch... He, the Grinch steals all the presents. But in the end of the movie, um... And the book, the Grinch... The Grinch realizes that everybody in the neighborhood... In Whoville still celebrate Christmas even without presents. And then in the end he ends up liking Christmas and he joins and he joins the girl who he encountered. Oh he hadn't ruined Christmas. It he hadn't ruined Christmas. The nerd Oops sorry, the nerd I just minimized the screen. Cold in the snow stood puzzling. 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 That's a good word. How could it be so? It came with bad They games. just laughed at the shitty Waldo. video games. <laughs> Goonies, Waldo and Too Rick. funny. Where's Waldo? That's my question. I've actually played, used to play that game. I love it. I still, I used to play Boris Waldo. I love that. I love that game. Maybe bad games mean a little bit more. Maybe bad games do mean a little bit more. Just like the Grinch did, he brought back all their presents. Nice. He brought everything back. All the games for the feast. And he himself, the nerd, played Beauty and the Beast. Nice, that's a good game. Welcome Christmas, bring your cheer. I've never Can't played it, but I have seen advertisements for that game, though. Welcome Christmas while we play. Some pretty fucking shitty games today. Indeed. Alright, that's the end of the video. That was actually a pretty funny video. This is actually the first time I've ever watched it. I've never watched this before, but um, I have watched 
the Angry Video Game Nerd Home Alone special, which I'm going to do that reaction video in another, in another video. But anyways, I will end my video here. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.